Bye, Beam. Maybe. We need your guys' help. I don't even know if you'll be able to tell the difference in the colors, but I'm trying to put it far back enough so that you can see what Allie's about to show you. So, we want to know, do you think that those, either of those two colors match with this floor? And have a close look if you can. We are thinking that those two colors don't work, but we want to know well, what you think. We anyway. think that one works, right? But when dark day, I mean, the gloomy table got some lights on, but if like, it would still look a very dark one, I make the room look smaller because the color right now we like, but it's just too samey. Yeah, it's just way, uh, it's just annoying so that everything just looks the same. The other one we're thinking is this. Yeah, so we think that one looks better because that is what our current floor looks like. So this would. Oh wait, we could just put that on the floor. <laughs> so that would with this color for the wall, but I don't, I keep thinking about jails. For that accent color, we're gonna do like blush pink cushions and then have some like green uh, planty things so it brings a lot of brightness. Yeah, I just, I'm, I really am worried though about what it will look like on, on a huge, cause this is our biggest wall. This in real life looks a little bit more browny and purpley. No, it's like minky. I just, I worry about the color being a really, really dark color. I don't know if it would just make us feel sad when it's gloomy, but, well this this color specifically is what I'm worried about too, because it's the closest. You get it more bluey, almost. I don't know if bluey Because those pictures that we've seen of the, sort of the kind of inspiration that we're basing yeah. it on, it looks very bright. It doesn't look like a dark, dull room. But remember, they, the people, oh my God. If you're squeamish about blood, look away. I don't know if you can see this on my finger. I also have a picture that I'm about to show you, but Alvis jumped up on my desk and I took him off and he accidentally scratched my face when I was putting him off. He wasn't angry or anything, but he, I think he's actually sorry because yeah. he, he, he didn't, he just stayed out of the room, didn't try bothering coming back in. Hey, what were we saying? Um, but yeah, the inspiration thing that we're using, uh, their room doesn't look dull. Yeah. And they've actually got less lighting than we do. Yeah, I guess, it, well, but they have big glass windows. I mean, whether we go with a tone almost between that and the hot water bottle. I wish you guys could see what we see in real life because the obviously really the camera doesn't properly. pick up the best color or our lighting doesn't help. I'm just gonna cook some stuff. I'm gonna put some stuff in the slow cooker and then we'll have dinner at 10 p.m. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, I love you, Beanie. Six hours later, it's still cooking, and to be honest, I'm probably being counterproductive by, you know, leaving this open for so long, but I wanted to show you that the chicken, when I tried to pick it up, it just basically shredded on its own, so it's very tender. Yum! Watch, watch. Ready? Not much pressure on it, so it's good. I'm gonna eat this soon. I'm so excited. So Allie is going to try the the food. We still have stuff down here. Ali's gonna try the soup. Mm. Really good? Really, really good. I'm glad. What do you think, Albus? It's a radiator. You've seen it before. <laughs> you sleep next to one. We still have some wood. Um, that's because it's on, and that's why. Mm. Oh, is it on? Mm. Oh, okay. Anyway, we're going to enjoy our dinner. Ali and I are having a discussion about a musical called Cats. That's good. I've never seen it, but I have so many questions. Number one, what is a jellicle and why does this not make you feel a weird? A jellicle is a grey cat that hangs around at night. We have parties and they're called <laughs> jellicle cats and they're like fuzzies. And why have you been emotional? Because I just think about all the different cats. <laughs> Ali and I have just had a weekend, and we just, uh, when I say we had a weekend, I don't mean that we had a great weekend. Lots of just uh, emotion. Too many TV shows. But when we started talking about Cats, the musical, what are you doing? Is it a rattling? Come here. It's just rice, little oh, boy. You look most like a Mr. Mistopheles. Oh. Black. 
And he's a magical kitten. <laughs> Does he look annoyed? Yep. <laughs> he put his head under my chin. You put his no, head under see, your chin. If I move my head away. Oh. What's that? Jellicle kitten, jellicles do. Jellicles and the jellicle cats. I don't know anything. Ali knows all the songs from cats. I know zero. What's Sorry that? if you're hearing the rattling, it's my rice. Anything else you'd like to add? <laughs> I love you. I don't know if you guys can oh. see, but it's snowing. No, you can't. Oh, you can just see the bigger chunks. So yeah, it's snowing. Let's hope it lies, because it was meant to snow all of last night, and it didn't really snow at all. Albus is interested too, because he's a kitten. I don't know if you can see that, but this is our hot pot. You just a pot on a hot plate. And normally I don't think you have chicken. I don't think it's traditional, but I wanted chicken. And I, and I think the reason you don't normally do it like this is because um, obviously you can't exactly, and you probably shouldn't cook raw chicken in five seconds and eat it. Um, we have our cabbage and some green beans. Green beans, green onions. Actually, I'll put about half of them in. For flavor. On one of my videos, I think it was my Hanoi bike shop video, I said that there's only one real kind of sriracha and people were like, no, there's different kinds and the answer is no. It was not by Hui Fong Foods. It ain't sriracha, it's pretend sauce. <laughs> and that's just me being biased. Uh, the end. <laughs> also, we have never actually done this kind of before. And that's because we thought that the spicy was the best way to go, but the last time we tried a new brand, uh, or a different brand, and it was basically a brick of fat, and it just tasted really oily and it didn't taste very good, so now we just decided to add our own hot oil and sriracha, whatever we like, to it, so... We'll see how this tastes, and I hope it tastes good. Let me know if you guys have had this before, and then what you guys use in your hot pot. Ali and I could not be bothered with any kinds of vegetables and I forgot to put in like half the things, but it's okay. I don't know, we've been searching for Thai milk tea that doesn't taste. I think the only place we've got it over here was... It was a little bit watered Manchester. down. No, remember the no, shop in... No, Slotport, did we not order some in? We never got no. some. We haven't had any. I haven't had Thai milk tea in two and a half years. So Ali was at Oka, which is a, a Japanese... I want to say conveni, but it's a convenience store and it has a bunch of different Asian foods. It doesn't have sinigang powder or whatever. I won't even be offended by that. We've been on search for Thai milk tea and Ali found was it Assam. So it is Assam milk tea and I think Assam is going to be slightly different. It's a black tea still, but yeah. it's obviously not Thai milk tea, but it's the only thing I could find. They had the Nest tea one, but or Nestle one or whatever, but we didn't want to try that. Yeah. It's a different color. Slightly different. Yeah, we'll just Let's it. just try it. Is it exact? Tea taste isn't quite as oh. strong. It's slightly watered down, but it's actually not bad. I don't think you're gonna get the same flavor as you do in a kind of restaurant made one. But try it. I can't smell anything. It's actually quite nice. I will put up with this. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. I like that. I'm happy because it's it's a nice substitute. I don't know if you could tell, but we put too many noodles in the pot, so now it's kind of like noodle mush. It's okay, it'll be fun, it'll be yummy. So Allie's gonna try the broth. Sorry, we have friends on in the background. Okay, so here we go. Those noodles are like just like a big, yeah. it's like congealed. Mm. It's a nice broth, isn't it's really it? sweet. That uh, definitely more water. You think so? Yeah. Have you tried a bit? Yeah. It's good, but it's really sweet. Sweet or salty? Sweet. That's weird. We are so we are so full. We ate everything, including the plates and the and utensils and the chopsticks. And look at all that. Ew! I haven't even looked. At it. That's why I said I'm not going to show it because it's just gross. You don't want to see that. Yeah, but it's okay. Yeah. It's not like we eat it all the time. We didn't except finish we do. all the meat this time. No, it's because I added chicken, and I'm also, I don't know, for some reason I'm just not that hungry. Which is a surprise to me! Anyway, we're gonna just relax and then have our celebratory muffins. When I say celebratory, I mean 
And I was going to pick up Tim Hortons today, but I didn't. And I'm really annoyed. It's okay. I love you, mean, mean. Love you too, mean.